country wine. What happened? What? Oh, please. This nigga was married the whole fucking time. Listen, had the lawyer call me, talking about, yeah, the divorce is like final. He had, he had taken me out of town. I wake up next day, shade room. I'm a fucking home wrecker and everything. Oh, I wake him up. Yeah, no, no. Get up out that heavenly sleep. Yeah. You but I yeah. must be honest with you. Yeah. You knew what the fuck he was getting into. This nigga had 38 kids. Ready for my wife. Right. When it got Jess, you know what I'm saying? And and that was it. I started talking to her. Right. And I got divorced. My divorce was four to five days. Right. You know what I mean? Right. And uh, me, me and her started talking. And then all the stuff she talking about on there, cause my baby mama hit me up. She was like, can you please ask Jess to stop talking about that? Because now the kids are hearing it at school because right. she keep bringing Making it up. And that's mm -hmm. the only reason made me hit her up. Right. I'm like, Jess, man, I ain't never said nothing negative about you. And everybody know that. Right. Let that ride. Right. You know what I'm saying? But she want to be the winner. I'm like, Jess, just be real. Because Charlamagne asked one time, he said, how you lose Jess Larry? I said, how she lose Country Wayne? I'm going to catch it. Right. What you talking about? Like, let's be real. My my baby mama was, yeah, they fine in the zone of what? Jess fine too. Right. But I've been had them. She ain't had no Country Wayne. Right. You know what I'm saying? So I'm like, man, let's just, let's stop that, man. First of all, it's two black people talking. Hey, kids. Yeah, but that don't mean, he, like, that don't mean shit. He told me, he said, I was married, but we are, we, we've been going through this uh, divorce for a whole year. We had to be separated for a year and whatever, but now it is final. I can get my lawyer on the phone. This was presented to me before I even was like, all right, we can be in a relationship. Mm. Because I, I was just getting out of a relationship. Mm. Talking to Jess. Yeah, I started talking to Jess. Okay. You know, all this stuff came out in the shade room. A lot of that was after that. Right. You know what I'm saying? Right. And she just, she say, we woke up, and then she was like, uh, I tell him all the time, his stuff corny. I'm like, why you got to call my stuff corny? Because I got a different audience that follow me, too. Right. You know what I mean? I got the streets in the church. Okay. Ain't too many artists got the streets in the church. You know what I mean? Man, what I be seeing, what you be talking about, you be making on social media month. That ain't nothing corny about that. That corny, but see, that's that mentality of people from a certain, it's like the this world think this world corny. This world think this world corny. I think Martin was a good show and Big Bang Theory. Right. Uh, uh, two different friends. audiences.